Thanks for watching my video today. Let's evaluate this integral. Integral of sin x over x dx. Okay. What can we do? I think there is no possible way to evaluate this one. Okay. But I know only one. Then is using our expansion. Okay. We know. Or you can check out my other video. Expansion of sine x is nothing but summation from n equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n x to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 factorial. Or meaning to say, if you simplify this, x minus x k by. 3 factorial plus x5 by 5 factorial minus and so on okay so we have this now let's apply here integral of sine x over x dx is integral of summation from n equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n x to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 factorial dx by x, right? Now let's say that this integral and summation can interchange, okay? So, since this is dependent of, independent of x, okay? So we can tell this to Because integral is with respect to x, okay? And this x and here x power 1 will cancel out. What do we have? x to the 2n dx, okay? Now this is, you can evaluate easily. What is this? x to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 plus constant of integration now let's expand it what do we get what kind of series we can get here mm. for this x minus uh, x cube by 3 into 3 factorial plus x 5 by 5 into 5 factorial minus and so on, okay? So this, this, or integral turn out to be this one, okay? So this is nothing but our sum from n equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 to the n x to the 2n plus 1 over 2n plus 1 2n plus 1 factorial so our integral is our integral sine x by x dx is turn out to be our x this series okay i think this is the only way we can this is the only possible way we can evaluate this integral okay yeah, that. This is how we evaluate, okay? Plus constant of integration.